happy that this is actually mine. <laughs> to move in today so let me do this really quick and so i want you guys to first hit that subscribe button down there support your girl and i want you to do some engaging in this video so i'm going to give you three engagement words throughout the video so i can know who rocking with your girl you know what i'm saying so throughout the empty house tour i'm going to give you three engagement words okay so I want you to drop them in the comments below. Ooh. I want you to drop them in the comments below and so I can know we're gonna have some chats, what you think, tell me what you like about the house, you know, all that. Let's just chat it up in the comments below. So I'm gonna give you the first engagement word, which is Coco. All right, so C-O-C-O. -C -O. Or you can give me an emoji. Give me the girl with the little cute look girl with the hand like this. All right. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and get into this video. So yeah, let's. So we are going to start this tour off in front of the door. So as you can see, I'm in this like little entryway. It's kind of bad, so. And we're gonna go to the right and this space right here. And I also have like this little entryway. This is really pretty. Um, right here. So on this side is technically the living room and the formal dining room. But I decided that I'm going to make this just all a living space. So we're just going to do seating throughout here. And we move the dining room over to the family room. So yeah, this right here. That's what it looks like. And I got to choose the color of the floor, which is a gray. So and as you can see, this house has like nice natural lighting. Um, so yeah, and then there's the stairs. I got to choose the carpet. I've never had gray carpet, but I am so in love with this gray carpet. It doesn't make any sense. Um, I guess because I have three kids, I've always had light colored, cream beige color carpet when I was in my actual apartments. So I decided, well, I got three kids. I need something that's gonna be able to be a little bit durable and maybe hide a little bit of stuff for me. So it's not too dark, it's not too light gray, it's like in the middle, you can see that. And then I got this, I chose this staining to kind of go like flow with the actual stairs. So yeah, and so yeah, and then I got this and there's a pretty color gray wall. It looks kind of cream, it's actually gray. And then right here, we have a, I guess, a coat closet. Nothing too special. Then when you come to the left side of the house, this is technically the family room. And I am going to change out that light fixture to something modern. But yes, this is the family room, but I'm making this the dining room. So I'm hoping that maybe I can put like a buffet table back there, maybe a mirror, change out this lighting. You can see it. Uh -huh. There we go. And bar stools over here. And then I want a longer table, a rectangle table, so that we can have gatherings here or family gatherings. Then you got like my little patio. And then when you come over here, you get to see the pretty kitchen. Um, at first, there is a powder room. Nice size for guests. And I might change out the fixtures, but I really love these. I know I'm weird, but like I've never had a faucet that does that. So like if you're washing something, you can move that out the way. So I think it's really pretty cool. Yep. 
And then this is the kitchen. So, yep, I'm not actually a cooker per se, but I think this is a pretty nice size for me to cook in, to start cooking, I guess. And so, yeah, so I picked out this refrigerator. Um, I've never had a side-by-side -side door, so I feel like an adult. I would say there's nothing in here. It's a nice, you know, a nice refrigerator. And I got to pick out, I used the standard, this came with the house. Um, the microwave and the oven. And I do apologize if this is like very horrible of a video. <laughs> I was trying, and then this was supposed to have actually just been a standard um, dishwasher, but because of COVID, they weren't able to get a hold of the standard one that kind of matched with this. I mean, I think it still looks nice, but so they was able to upgrade me to a nicer dishwasher. And I don't know if I'm the only person um, that still washes dishes in the sink. I really probably only washed dishes in a dishwasher, probably two times before, but it's supposed to be like a top grade dishwasher. So I guess I should start learning. Um, so comment below if, I, am I the only one that still washes dishes this way? This is how I was taught. Um, I never really used a dishwasher, but it's a pretty dishwasher. And so yeah, I picked out this countertop. It's granite. It has like some blueberry, not blueberry, cranberry, sorry. Cranberry little spots in it. So I thought that was a really pretty, way to bring some color into here. And I wanted white countertops, white cabinetry, not white countertops, I'm sorry, white cabinetry. So I was actually able to pick that out as well. And I might change out these little knobs, I don't know, cause I like these ones better. And I have the trash can and the cabinet that I upgraded to. Okay. And then so like my cabinets, they're a nice size cabinets. So yeah, you're gonna see more cooking videos, baking videos, a little bit of sippy sip videos. So yeah. And we also have, I guess these are called the recess light, can light, but it also can dim, which is pretty cool. So yeah, this is my kitchen. And I have a pantry, which is right here which is a slash storage. My dad's thinking about adding a couple of shelves here to give me some more pantry space. But yeah, this is what it came with. And it has a light. So it gives me a lot of space for all my snacks and stuff. So yeah, I definitely wanna do an organizational video. So look out for that. So yeah. Cause this time I'm gonna try to be organized in this house, guys. I really wasn't that organized in my apartment. So yeah, now we're gonna go up the stairs. Up the stairs we go. It's a little dark, I probably should have turned the light on, sorry. There we go. All right, so this is my little hallway, nothing crazy. I'm gonna go to this room, which is the boys' room. Well, enough size for them. They're only six and four. So this is gonna be their room. Um, so yeah, and drop some comments below what, guys, what kind of things you suggest if my boys want a sports room, um, where I should get some things from this is their closet nice size closet got probably just mess that up so like looks like this so they want to put their tv here bed over here i'm going to go to the closet so yeah Karan wants a sports theme room. And I think it's gonna be the gray, brown, and blue as the color. So just check out, watch for that video coming. All right, that was their room. 
And then when you come over here, it's my laundry closet. And it has a light in here, I think. But yeah, this is the laundry closet. I think my dad is going to put more shelves up here for me for storage. Since weirdly enough, this house doesn't have a linen closet, which is weird, but it's okay. So I'm thinking like if we put some shelves up there, that'll give me some room to store some things. And I got to pick out this flooring or whatever it's called. <laughs> it was my second choice because it was actually an upgrade, but because of COVID, we had to change it. We couldn't get a, the actual one we wanted. Now this is Nala's room. So we're doing for her room a safari theme to just go with the Lion King, Nala, those type of vibes. So just check out for that video. In her closet, I believe it looks the same as the boys' closet. Oh, yep. And this is her room. And then we have the kids' bathroom slash guest bathroom, which is a nice bathroom, nice standard bathroom. And hi. <laughs> um, we have white countertops, which I like. Everything looks clean. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I didn't turn any lights on. I never changed those out to brighter lights, but yeah, this is the bathroom. And then we are headed to the last room. Oh, and by the way, <laughs> back here. Screw, 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 screw. It's time for another engagement word. So I want you to drop in the comments below. I want you to drop lit, L-I-T. Or you can drop the fire emoji and let me know that you're still watching with me. So yeah, we're about to wrap it up anyway. So that was the second engagement word. And so now we are in the master bedroom. I have the tray ceiling. It looks so pretty now that they finished it. So yeah, it was really cool to see this house actually be built. Yeah, this is my room. The agent that was working with me is gonna install the those plugs up there so I can have the cordless look. Then I'll put me a desk over there, a bed over there. I think this is a really good size bedroom for myself. And it has some great lighting in it without, you know, and it's still building out here. And then this is the master bathroom. So yeah, this is the master bathroom. Which, oddly enough, I actually like that I have one sink because I can have room to put what I want over there, room to put up there. Like, I might get like a little speaker in here because I like to listen to music when I get dressed or do my hair. But yeah, this is a nice, I might change this out. My dad likes it, but I might change that out, but not right now. Um, so yeah. Okay, so back to this. So I have little white cabinets throughout the house. Simple. And I think I will have like a organ organization video of my hair products because I am actually getting a whole lot of products or buying them. And then, so right here to the left is my little closet. <laughs> my little closet. Um, it's a walk-in closet. It's enough space. I actually, for me to be a girl, I really don't have that much stuff. I don't know why. But it's a nice size closet. It has some stuff up here that I can hang. I can actually put like probably, you probably can't see it, put something right there for like shoes probably. Like I said, I don't have that much stuff, but this is a really good size walking closet. 
and then I have a stand-up shower, which I thought I wasn't gonna. Whoop. Sorry, it's in there. <laughs> but, oh, and I've never had one of these. I don't know why it's actually on the ground or down. But yeah, I've never had one of these, so I feel real fancy now. So yeah, I got a walk-in shower, and okay, kinda don't wanna put my shoes in here, but. I just like everything that's white, clean. And then you have the little toilet room. So yeah, that is it up here at the, yeah, this is my outfit. I really don't look like I'm moving. I'm doing like mad things today. Oh, let me turn this light off because this actually has a light in here. Keep all the lights off. So yeah, that is it for the top of, well, the upstairs part of our house. So I love it, really love it for our first house. And I love the view, it's so pretty. So yeah. yeah. really hope it wasn't too bad. So I'm gonna give you guys the last engagement word, which is house. So you can put house, H-O-U-S-E, or you can do the emoji, the house emoji. But yeah, I don't know why I just did that. But thank you so much, guys. Thank you for all my friends, family, for helping me out, supporting me. Um, I'm super proud. I can't wait to actually live here. Um, like I said, we're moving the things in because Things happen with the FHA part. Um, so hopefully we'll be in here next week. And so I'm super excited for more videos. So definitely check out that we're gonna have like hauls. We're gonna do room makeovers, um, organizing videos, cooking videos, drink videos, cause you know. Your girl is bar <laughs> tender Coco. So yeah, so thank you. I don't wanna keep you. So make sure you like this video, share it. Let me know that you rock with your girl. Share this video, like it, comment down. Make sure you do those engagement words. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so happy that this is actually mine. So yeah, so thank you.